Hello friend, welcome back to my channel. Today in this video, I will show you how to spoof the Monster Hunter Now on your iOS device. Introducing the global first launch of iAnyGo. Now better than ever, no jailbreak required. No risk of bans play. With peace of mind, access the original of Monster Hunter Now directly from the App Store and start spoofing spoof locations seamlessly on the latest iOS 18 without a hitch. Say goodbye to error, 12 location issues. It's finally fixed. Unlock new adventures with Ianigo, your ultimate location spoofing tool. Many of you know we are facing error challenge while spoofing on of Monster Hunter Now. Go now, Ianigo, which is available for iOS and Android. This the the best location. Change your app in the market for iOS. No jailbreak or root required to use this software. You can change your GPS location to any place. This software will work with all GPS base apps and games. From here, you can download. Let me show you how to spoof with this software. First, connect you mobile with computer through cable. Then click Start and select USB. Then select Specific Game Mode. This the interface on the top left corner. You can see search bar. And on the right corner, you can see all small icon, all our main feature teleport mode. One spot, multi-spot, joystick and jump teleport mode. First, let me show you teleport mode on the left side. There is a search bar. You can search any location by name or coordinate. The pinpoint on the map where you want to teleport and click move. As you can see on my left, mobile screen, my device location changed. You can teleport and catch rare monsters, but keep in mind, respect the cooldown time. If you wanted to teleport anywhere, just wait two hours for cooldown time. Let me show you another method to one spot mode. In this, you have to select one point on the map, adjust the speed, and click move. As you can see my avatar in the game. Also moving, this is like auto walks feature. Now let me show you multipot mode. So essentially, all you, what you can do is you can go ahead and click lots of different places all over the map. And then you can click go and you can do some realistic mode. I would always uh, recommend that because we don't want to get you guys banned. And of course, always use alternate accounts. If you can, you can also do some loops so you can have this running loads and loads and loads of times so that you can do it while you're doing other things while you're asleep. It can also hatch eggs, all sorts of things. And of course, while it is running, you can interact with everything on the map, just like you would be in the normal game. So it's really, really cool. So make sure you can go ahead and use this. Let me show you another method. Jump teleport mode. Create multiple point on the map and click move. It will teleport you to that location. You can also go back to previous location. It will teleport to you on that location. Let me show you last and my favorite features joystick mode. In this first adjust, the walking speed after that move. Any directions you want, you can move 360 degrees anywhere. Any directions and catch monsters on the game. If you have any question, comment down below. Thank you for watching.